Alice Cornelius Celsus, Wikipedia article audio. Alice Cornelius Celsus was a Roman encyclopedist, known for his extant medical work, De Medicina, which is believed to be the only surviving section of a much larger encyclopedia. The De Medicina is a primary source on diet, pharmacy, surgery, and related fields, and it is one of the best sources concerning medical knowledge in the Roman world. The lost portions of his encyclopedia likely included volumes on agriculture, law, rhetoric, and military arts. He made contributions to the classification of human skin disorders in dermatology, such as Mermshia, and his name is often occurring in medical terms about the skin, e.g., Carrion Celsi and Area Celsi. Nothing is known about the life of Celsus. Even his prenomen is uncertain, he has been called both Aurelius and Aulus, with the latter being more plausible. Some incidental expressions in his De Medicina suggest that he lived under the reigns of Augustus and Tiberius, which is confirmed by his reference to the Mycen as being recently in his old age. It is not known with any certainty where he lived. He has been identified as the possible dedicator of a gravestone in Rome, but it has also been supposed that he lived in Narbonne Skull, because he refers to a species of vine which, according to Pliny, was native to that region. It is doubtful whether he practiced medicine himself, and although Celsus seems to describe and recommend his own medical observations sanctioned by experience, Quintilian says that his volumes included all sorts of literary matters, and even agriculture and military tactics. Life Works Of the numerous volumes of his encyclopedia, only one remains intact, his celebrated treatise on medicine. The work a Euro trademark S encyclopedic arrangement follows the tripartite division of medicine at the time as established by Hippocrates and Asclepiades a Euro diet, pharmacology, and surgery. It is divided into eight books. In the Prumium or Introduction to De Medicina there is an early discussion of the relevance of theory to medical practice and the pros and cons of both animal experimentation and human experimentation. In the treatment of disease, Celsus' principal method was to observe and watch over the operations of nature, and to regulate rather than oppose them conceiving that fever consisted essentially in an effort of the body to throw off some morbid cause, and that, if not unduly interfered with, the process would terminate in a state of health. On occasions, however, he boldly recommends the use of the scalpel, his rules for bloodletting and purgatives are laid down with detail and precision, and many of the rules he prescribes were not very different from those still in use at the beginning of the 19th century. His work contains detailed descriptions of the symptoms and different varieties of fever, and he is credited with recording the cardinal signs of inflammation known as Celsus tetrad, calor, dolor, tumor, and rubor. He goes into great detail regarding the preparation of numerous ancient medicinal remedies including the preparation of opioids. In addition, he describes many first-century Roman surgical procedures which included removal of a cataract, treatment for bladder stones, and the setting of fractures. During the 20th century, Many historians claimed that Celsus believed that the crystalline lens is in the exact center of the eye. In fact, Celsus made no specific statement about the position of the crystalline lens, and his Greco-Roman contemporaries did understand that the lens is located to the front. Hippocrates used the Greek word carcinos, meaning crab, or crayfish, to refer to malignant tumors. It was Celsus who translated the Greek term into the Latin cancer, also meaning crab. 
The first printed edition of Celsus' work was published in 1478. His style has been much admired as being equal in purity and elegance to that of the best writers of the Augustan age. Also, Celsus wrote a technical work on agriculture, on which Columella partly based his De Re Rustica. Book 1 A Euro The History of Medicine, Book 2 A Euro General Pathology, Book 3 A Euro Specific Diseases, Book 4 A Euro Parts of the Body, Book 5 and 6 A Euro Pharmacology, Book 7 A Euro Surgery, Book 8 A Euro Orthopedics. In hoc valve mine hec continent ver avra lee corneliae celsi medicini libri 8, quam emen data simi, grisus entium omnibus dictionibus restivtus. Beige fa one fourth gte werca, quinti sereni liber de medicina et ipsi castigatus. Accedit index in cells vm et seren vm sane quam copios vs. Venates, in Edibs Aldi et Andreatis Vlani Soceri, 1528. Digital edition of the University and State Library de 1 4th Seldorf, Aurelii Cornelage Celsi de Arte Medica Libri Octo, Multis in Losis I am Emende Shores Longa, Qua M Unquam Antia, Edity. Beige Fa 1 4th GTE Werka. Accessit quoquirum and verborum in his omnibus memorabilium locuplatissimus index. Basilii, Perinus, 1552 Digital Edition of the University and State Library de 1 4th Seldorf, or. Corn. Celsi de Medicina, Libri Octo, Cum Notus Integris Jonis Caesarii, Roberti Constantini. Josie Scali Jerry, Isa I K Saboni, Jonis Baptisti Morgani, A C Losis Parallelis, Lugduni Batavarum, Joe, Arn, Lung Iraq, 1746, Digital Edition of the University and State Library de One Fourth Seldorf.